Welcome back to the channel everyone and today I'm bringing you Man City we're away at Man City at the Etihad and as you can see the Premier League is shaping up quite nicely so as we can see we're sitting pretty on top on 29 points Man United are breathing down our throats however we've got a game in hand on them today so we could really make a statement today however we do have a tough run of games coming up, playing three of the top four with a Champions League group game in the middle. As we can see in the squad, the injury crisis is still going on now. Salah was picking up a knock as well. We've also got gender. We've also got Jordan Henderson suspended for this game. So this is their lineup. So I'm not happy about having Ox on the wing, I'm not happy about having Coyle in midfield, and I'm not happy with having Trent as a deep line and playmaker. I suppose... Um, he can tackle. He can tackle. So we could play the Ox. I don't like... I think Coyle will just get wrecked. And we'll go like that, because Woodburn hasn't been too bad. So let's have a look how he has actually been. So, 7 appearances, 1 goal, but 4 assists though, 7.17. For a youngster, that's not, that's not dreadful for 18 year old. And his stats are going up really quick. Alright, this is the squad we're going with. Mane's a bit knackered, Van Dyke's a bit knackered, but... We're going against Man City. Let's see what we can do. Let's see their line-up. I don't know if they've bought any new players. Or if it's just, you know, the usual suspects. So here we go. So the usual suspects. The only surprise is Yaya Torre. Gets a rare start, it has to be said, for Man City. And then Bravo's in goal. But when you've got Aguero, Silva, Sane, De Bruyne, you know. Alright. So we're going to tell the fans. Come on. I'm happy with a draw, I think I'd, with the injury problems, la -de da da I think I'd take a draw very happily. So, De Bruyne is going to run the show. Bravery, so we're going to go in hard on him. What's his long shots? Long shots, so we'll just go, just leave it like that for now. Well, yeah, yeah, to worry. his bravery is quite high. Silver, Sane, another one with low bravery, Aguero, would have thought you'd have had lower bravery, just after all them injuries, do you know what I mean, there's only so many injuries you can take before you're getting a bit worried, and that was the problem with Daniel Sturridge in real life, I think it was Klopp's, either his first season or second season, basically hinting that Daniel Sturridge was sort of like, any little knock and he was sort of worrying, which you can't blame him. Although know, I have to admit, I don't rate him as high as most people do. You know, I think you have to acknowledge what Suarez did for that team. And I don't think it's... Um, well, I do think it's strange that, you know, his one breakout star season also happened to be with Suarez and since then... You know, if I'm a striker next to Suarez, I'm not. For, even if I get a knock, I'm not coming off. I'm bullshitting. Do you know what I mean? All right, Firmino's on a fairly length of run without a goal. Thank you. I hope. F yeah, we can't afford passengers. Beckham. Um. Yeah. Obviously, I'd rather have them today, but you know, beggars really can't be choosers. Right, I'm hoping just not for that, that's what I'm hoping for. Not to just give it away for the sake of it. Man City are a good team. And they could really put some pressure on with a win today. Hoping we've got enough about us. But, you know, when we miss Salah. And Trent's obviously in midfield, I hope he's... And put in a shift, it's one of them things. Woodburn can't get to that. I do like Emery Khan, I did give him another contract. Someone did suggest selling him, we might look at doing that if we're 
looking for cash. I don't know if that'll be in January. It'll take something big to sort of rob him from January. But especially when Kyoto arrives in the summer. That's when we can look at maybe shifting someone along. Sarnai launches a shot, but it just sort of cannons off. I'm alright if we're limiting you to that. Guerra. I thought he was going to do something magical then. That's a Sarno. It's a De Bruyne up. They do play nicely on the ball. Has to be said. He gets the cross in. That's fine. I'm happy with crosses. Like I've always said, I'm not, I'm not fussed. Especially with this team. We've got two big centre-backs. Van Dijk has been a rock. He's been my star player. Oh, we are having shots, though. Had three shots, two on target. No, it doesn't mean anything because we haven't seen what the shots look like. Do you know what I mean? They could have just been long shots that didn't really do anything. It could, you know, I don't think them stats tell you the whole game. It's like when people, or oh, Trent, or oh, no, it's like when people are like, oh, I had thirty shots and twenty on target, and the computer only got two and one. It FM'd me. That drives me insane. I don't play the game. I just think it doesn't show me, and especially when it says clear cut chances, I don't rate a lot of the clear cut chances. Because a lot of the time it can be like, oh, come on. Good header. But you know, like a clear cut chance can be like a header when you're marked on goal and it goes over. That's not an easy shot. Oh, just before half time, that's that's frustrating. I do expect to see a lot more. Hard to be too angry, to be honest. I know we haven't really offered anything, but I didn't think we've done too bad. Let's go tactics. We put Ox on attack, and we will just make sure we're getting stuck in. I'm debating about that ball winning midfielder, you know. I'm debating about changing it. Maybe to a um, CM on support. So no. I say it like we've had a terrible season, but... I'm just not convinced with that role, to be honest. I don't know if it really suits this system. I thought that was going to be another goal. Still kind of analyst. We're st still quite compact free. The ball winning midfield is going to be drawn out, which is fine. But I know when we had oh oh great save, great save. I know when we had the free uh, playmakers, we were quite. I felt the midfield looked very static. They were very similar positions. Oh, Mane has just gone off injured. It's not what we want, it's not what we want. Alright, so we'll go Woodburn over here. And put him a winger on attack. Ox can turn into a Mazala in support, because I don't want him to overlap with a winger. And we'll put Brewster on, that's really bad, we really could do without that. Ugh. Gomez is on a 6.3. There's not really anything we can do about it. Ox can't really control that. We're going to have to splash this cash in January, I tell you. Silver to De Bruyne. De Bruyne brings it forward very comfortably. But Robinson picks it, you know, intercepts it. Very sexy. Ox to Woodburn. Finds Ox. To Firmino, to Brewster, yes! Get in. Tell you what, Brewster. He's gone under my radar since I've been here. And I tell you what, a couple of times I've brought him on, he has saved us. But still a lot of football left. I like the link up between that winger and that Mazala role. It'll be interesting to see if they link up like that again, otherwise, that might be something to look at moving forward. Because that gave something different to our team. So let's see. Ox to Woodburn. Woodburn can't get it at that time, which is a shame. Because the winger then plays further up, as we can see here. 
We just want to see how he links up with Ox. To Can. Oh, he had a chance there. No Firmino. He's not flourishing. Well, saying that, he did get the assist to tell a lie. I was about to say he's not flourishing in our system. His role is in an out and out you know, striker as a false nine. Not, you know, I don't want him to get all the goals. I know it sounds terrible. I want him to play him off for their inside forwards like that to come in and grab him because I feel like that's where our main attack is. But anyway, here they come again. Oh, that's that's a lot of space he had there. That was illegal how much space he had there. Like Gomez finds Trent, finds Emery Khan, finds Firmino. We can pass it around. Oh, I thought that was going to be a bit of a, a bit of a mare from the defenders, keeping the ball well. Oh, that's just lazy. It's just terrible. And now look at him break with that speed. Sterling, all he's got to do is square it, and Aguero somehow can't get the shot off. If that's not a warning shot, I don't really know what is. The defence is nervous, let's just tell everyone, let's encourage everyone. That's an optimistic ball at best by Van Dijk. Looks like Trent, it looks like I've left Trent on to man mark. Um, Aguero, he's playing very deep. Or is that just me? Firmino finds Ox, finds Woodburn, they link up again. Woodburn. Oh! Oh, he nearly did. Even the commentator, he nearly put that in his own net. That would have been funny. The Ox. Firmino. He gets the shot off, but straight out the keeper. That wasn't great by Woodburn. And here they come on the break, and that's a good tackle by Gomez. And he had a poor first half, but he has brought it back. I'll tell you what, this hasn't been a classic, this game. But I did say I would take a draw. I'm worried about how long Mane's out for. Potential knee injury. But Salah should be back in the next couple of games. We do need him for this big run of games. That's the problem. And we're playing three of the top four. So... I'm happy, it would have been nice to perhaps nick the win, but it's probably been far too greedy. Well, I just made a couple of substitutes, keeping everyone, well, trying to keep everyone fresh. Might have to think about perhaps using this system going forward. Playing the Mazzara and the Winger. I have liked how they linked up on a couple of occasions. Interesting. So I do like the Mazzara role. Problem is, I, always, I, do, I never know what its best combination is with an inside forward or with a winger. I feel a winger support is much more forward. Where personally, I think, especially a Mazzara on attack and an inside forward on attack, they play in a very similar position. I thought they were going to break my heart then. But one all, I'll take that. Difficult game. And especially going 1 0 down as well. Right. Here we go to Trent, Firmino. Well, Bobby does get it back. Brewster's onto it. Can he cross a ball in? Can he cross. Can, 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 can he cross a ball in? No, he can't. And that's it. Not a bad result, really, is it? You know, I know we we got more on target, but I don't really think anyone was panicking on the Man City side. We didn't pierce their team, apart from the time we scored, really. Um, I'll just put unlucky, boys. I'll just leave it like that, because I'll end up pissing them off. Because I'm happy, I think they've done well, but... Oh, here we go. There we go, out for two to three months.
What is going on with these injuries? I've never had a game like this. Never had a game like this. Even Dyke is really injured. Like my training's only average. Should we put it low for a while? Like for the next year. This is crazy. No, don't be silly. Where's the medical center? Obviously they're all gonna be high. This is a screen I've never used. I'm gonna have to start using it then maybe. The problem is if you go in a match and it's like I don't know, Ox is high, Van Dyke's high, Firmino's high, it's like well I can't not play them all. Do you know what I mean? But maybe there is something in this screen that I need to start paying attention to. Because this is crazy. Look at all this. I do like this. I haven't actually. This is the longest I've ever spent on this screen. Time missed this season. Five months, five months, three months, three months, two months. That's big. I wonder if it shows us. Here we go. Best. Remember best. Fewest injuries in the Premier League. I can't be asked, we've got the most. I don't understand that. Well, the seventh most. So it says best at the bottom. Don't really get what that means. Okay. So, and Khan suspended. Henderson should come back there, yeah. Okay, so then we've got Salzburg in the Champions League. We've got Arsenal, and then we'll be back for the United game. It's going to be a tricky, tricky time. But if we can get past this, then we've still got December to come, but then, you know, Chelsea to greet us midway through December. But no, I think we'll be all right. I think we'll be all right. <laughs> I'm trying to convince myself. Anyway, thanks for joining me, everyone. You've been you. I've been me. See you later. Bye-bye.